Winter Cut Day 79. Boys, I'm mentally done with the cut, but we got 10 more freaking pounds to go on this cut. That's all we need to lose is 10 more pounds. And then we can embrace the bulk. I yearn for the bulk. Liquid freaking progress. It's going to be an absolutely insane bulk. It's going to be like Jay Cutler, okay? 2006, Mr. Olympia beat Ronnie Coleman. Just eating and shoveling down food and shoveling down massive amounts of food. This bulk on the channel is going to make absolute history. It's going to be record-breaking, boys. I don't know what kind of record, but it's going to be record-breaking and legendary. But we're in the home stretch of the cut. We need to get this thing done. So 10 more pounds till I reach my goal weight. I'm already freaking striated and sinewy, okay? And I got all kinds of random, you know, things coming in, veins and whatnot from this cut. But, again, 10 more pounds from now. Imagine this physique with 10 less pounds of fat. Now, keep this in mind, boys. I've been getting stronger and making gains on the cut. Imagine how expedient that process would be on the bulk. Now, I'm going to leave you guys off with that. Just letting you know how I feel about the cut and the bulk. I really want to bulk so bad, but boys, the cut to me is just a means to an end. I don't have plans on competing. I've thought about it. I've thought about it thoroughly. And to be honest, it's just something I'm not ready for. But eventually, boys, when I do step on stage, it's going to be absolutely freaking legendary. I'm going to actually know how to pose. Um, I'm thinking about the Sergio Oliva pose, so let me just get that done and out of the way right now. Okay, I hope that looked as cool as I thought it did. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to slam some vitamin D3 and some creatine because I kind of low-key forgot to take it. Get ready for bed. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow for a freaking rambunctious chest day. All right, take care.